everyone, this is Jeff. Today is Tuesday, November 16th, 2021. I am back here at the scene of the crime. This is uh, Minnesota Avenue and Mosley Drive, right next to A. Crawford Mosley High School. I'm on the sidewalk right in front of it. Just down the road down here, I believe, is where uh, Jason of Amagansett Press and his son Ben of Watching the Watchmen were arrested, falsely arrested, and falsely accused of violating Florida's school safety zone statute, a completely unconstitutional uh, statute that it appears cops are just too unintelligent to be able to enforce properly and needs to be stricken from the books completely. Uh, in Gray v. Cole, a case law that occurred years ago, a federal judge said that the statute was unconstitutionally vague and forever uh, enjoined law enforcement from enforcing that school safety zone statute law. But uh, as you know, m many of you know, I myself have been arrested under the Florida School Safety Zone statute. Can I ask why you're here? I am peacefully assembling and peacefully protesting. Okay. There's a provision in there that says it uh, shall not infringe on a person's right to peacefully assemble and protest. If you check, if you look at the statute, it's right there okay. in the statute. So that's why I'm here. This is within the 500 foot safety rule. So I'm placing you under arrest for violation of that no trespass order. If you would, put your sign down, turn your phone off. Put your hands behind your back, please. You guys, I'm just telling you, if you look at the statute, there's a, in the okay. statute it specifically says uh, there's an exception for people peacefully assembling and protesting. Is that if they don't have a trespass warning for the property? Uh, it just... <laughs> uh, charges were dropped immediately. Jason was officially arrested of Amagansett Press. Uh, within six hours, our, he was out of jail, and then he was, uh, the charges were dropped pretty quickly thereafter. It's an unconstitutional statute and they need to strike it from the books. But uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stand out here with my God bless the homeless veteran sign, and I'm going to say, God bless the homeless vets, and exercise my right to freedom of speech, freedom of religion, and freedom of assembly on public property. Let's see how it goes. How's it going? <laughs> doing all right? God bless homeless vets. <laughs> you too, sir. Thank you. Looks like they got the cops over there, though. Yeah. You're an intelligent man, and I know that. Thank you. So you know what the concerns are. Right. You're you know, I can tell. You're not what people might think you appear to be. Oh, okay. So, people are concerned about children. Oh, okay. So, that's the only... Well, there's no no, no reason to be concerned about the children. I have no ill will, no ill intent. I'm good to go. Now, I don't think y'all, but people... Yeah, yeah. Their perception yeah. of, you know, if you was out here in the suit, nobody would say anything. Right. And that's a shame, isn't it? Uh, I'm from New York City. I'm yeah. from the Bronx. Right. So normal to me well you say you can tell i'm intelligent i don't know about that i'm a i'm a truck driver so I, there's a reason that's, the mean, that's, the meaning. <laughs> I mean, I know, that's my joke that's my joke i know a lot of intelligent truck drivers uh, there's a reason i'm a truck driver <laughs> but anyway day, you too you have a blessed day thank you god bless you i'm good how are you sir good, all right. yeah Hey, we got a call. Somebody was worried about you. Said you're out here holding a sign. Yeah, I'm just saying with the God bless the homeless sign. Oh, okay. Yeah. Understood, understood. Yeah. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, yeah, no, they just called us in to come out and do a welfare check on you. Just come out and make sure yeah, you're okay. I'm fine. Okay, I'm understood. Help. No assistance or anything like that. I'm good. I'm sorry? I'm no, no assistance or anything like that. Okay, understood. Yeah. Are you a homeless vet? Uh, I just, I'd rather not answer too many questions like that. I just, okay, no, yeah. that's fine. You don't all have right. to if you don't want to. All right. I mean, you're, you're more than welcome to do whatever you please. All right. Appreciate you. Okay. Right. You have a good rest of your day, sir. All right, you too. Hey, um, can I ask, is your body camera recording? I'm sorry? Is your body camera recording? Yes, sir. Okay, great. Ever since I got out of the car. Uh, and Officer Walsh? Yes, sir. All right, thank you. Yes, sir. No Y'all have a blessed day. Yes, sir. You as well. Thank you. 
Well, there you have it. It appears that the uh, law enforcement around here has learned that the school safety zone statute is unconstitutional. Even though it was a different agency that uh, responded to me, it was the city of Lynn Haven Police Department that responded to me. And it was the Bay County Sheriff's Department that arrested, falsely arrested, Jason and Ben of Amagansett Press and Watching the Watchmen. Um, looks like the law enforcement has learned, but maybe the school officials still uh, uh, need to be taught some lessons about uh, individual rights and civil rights. But anyway, uh, Jason, if you're out there, uh, I would like to get in touch with you. Please reach out to me. Try to contact me through Facebook. Send me your number. I'll call you. I've been arrested under this unconstitutional statute myself. Uh, I would like to sue the state of Florida. I'd like to go after the state of Florida itself and uh, get the law off the books completely. Get it struck down and taken off the books completely because law enforcement just is too stupid to understand how to even enforce this law. Anyway, reach out to me, Jason.